Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. We'll have every kick of the ball for you live on EA TV. Hello and welcome to the Al Bayt Stadium here in the northern Qatari city of Alcor. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson. And it is a first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Qatar and they take on Senegal. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. And here's the Qatar starting 11. Well, they're playing with a 5-2-3, as we can see it here. But I think at times we'll see one of the centre-backs stepping forward into midfield just to make sure they don't get outnumbered in that central area. And a look at the starting lineup for Senegal. Edouard Mendy stands between the posts. Sheku Kouyate starts alongside Idrissa Gay in central midfield. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And now they get the ball rolling. And it's a quality pass. And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1 0. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Diata. Idrissa Gay. High quality defending. Boudiaf. Chance to do damage. My goodness, the importance of getting there was not lost on the keeper. Kuyase. Sa. Boule Dia. That's a well struck pass. Idrissa Gay. And taken cleanly by the goalkeeper. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. Surely the equaliser. The crossbar got in the way. 
And a time for calm on the ball. Now well, nothing comes of it. It looks promising. Fed over towards the back post. And a goal to really bolster things for them. Two in front. Well, as we see it again, just watch how well the cross is delivered. Low, hard and accurate. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Fancy footwork. Well, that effort was always going wide. He's not going to be best pleased with himself. Well, they couldn't keep it. Well, in the end, nothing really to worry the keeper about. Promising looking attack. And teammates to play it to. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. And that pass could be troublesome. Will he finish? And there it is! Still life left in this game, and they have the momentum now. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. Goal! Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. Ahmed. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. And we could really get at the opposition. And there it is, the half-time whistle. And so the battle commences. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. This looks more than decent. Can he finish? Brilliantly blocked. On a poor touch, really, and unable to prevent the corner. Who can they pick out? Unable to get a body in the way. And clears his lines. Good movement. Cisse. Oh, yes! He's going to be proud of that moment. What purity of strike. Caught it absolutely perfectly. Well, here it is again, and just look how he sets himself ready to hit this. He judges the flight of the ball perfectly, and what a sweet connection. That's a brilliant goal. away again and it's a story of parity two goals apiece in this one Sabali 
Kuyate. Nice looking pass. And a really single minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. Wants to attack from the wide areas. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. Couldn't keep it. Breaking at pace. Well, not to be in terms of the counter attack. Chance to attack using width. Who can he pick out? Well, the referee wasn't going to let that go. Dia. Ali can't argue with that little move and they will be awarded a free kick for that can they hit on the break challenge well they really had to be on their toes defensively given the circumstances it's not lost on them what a goal could mean at this late stage could be and off the post just wanted to get it out of there so can he put them in front no the question and that could be so important at this stage well will they get another chance that would surely have won the game for them a oh, very effective play and they might be onto something well let's see what they have in store for them on the break and with that the attack fizzles out Threading it forward. Puyate. On to Saw. It has to be. Still could be dangerous. Well, able to survive that attacking push. And there is the referee's whistle for full time. Even Stephen here, they can't be separated. We were triggered to goals. And Stuart, interested to get your verdict. Well, Derek, what a good game it was. Plenty of chances, some good attacking play, and a couple of outstanding individual performances. I really enjoyed that one. His performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Stuart. Well, he posed a lot of problems with his energy today. He scored a good goal, and he was slightly unlucky when he hit the woodwork. He'll be pleased with his performance, though.